Hi, my name is Joe Zamora and I am a solutions expert for New Blue. Today I will be walking through the BitFocus companion integration and how we use it to control and play out spreadsheet data from a Google Sheet or local sheet. This feature allows users to trigger specific playout actions from BitFocus companion. An example of one of these interactions is using a single button to play a specific row from a spreadsheet. Let's get started. Open a entire live project containing a graphic layer that has a Spreadsheets or Google Sheets data controller assigned to it. For this example, a Google Sheets file will be assigned to a sports statistic lower third. The file in the example contains player data on two separate sheets. Now that a Spreadsheet data controller has been assigned, launch the BitFocus Companion software. Configure workflow preferences and launch the GUI. Additional configurations can be set when launching the browser window. Once that has been set, the connection to Tatter Life must be established. The window will launch with the Connections tab open by default, and a panel to the right will be found to add a connection. Search for the new blue Tatter Life connection by using Tatter Life as a keyword. Add the connection. Once added, the connection status of the added item will indicate with a green box and OK that Tatter Life has successfully established a connection to BitFocus Companion. After connected, Select the Buttons tab. Navigate to the right panel and select Presets. The presets will display a number of options, including a preset for local spreadsheets and or Google Sheets. The example project will have Google Sheets available. Select the option to reveal all the buttons available. These buttons can be dragged into the GUI interface to be usable from any of the button interface emulators that BitFocus Companion can host. The available buttons are the Select Next button, which is used to select the next row from the spreadsheet. The Select Previous button, which is used to select the previous row from the spreadsheet. The Select Row button, which is used to select a specific row from the spreadsheet. This row is selected by entering the row's index number. The Select By Value button is used to select a row in the spreadsheet by targeting a column from the sheet and entering the exact value to match. Note that while your graphic layer is on air, select previous, select next, select row, and select value buttons will animate in the new row of data instructed by the action. The select sheet button is used to select which sheet is being controlled by BitFocus Companion when multiple sheets are connected to a Tether Live project. The autoplay button is used to toggle autoplay on or off. This will select rows from your sheet in chronological order. The refresh button is used to refresh the spreadsheet data controller to fetch the latest changes done to the spreadsheet file. This button is exclusive to Google Sheets and Excel. A select variety of buttons provide the option to follow the active sheet, which will carry over the button presets to the active sheet selected for control. There are two buttons that serve as feedback to provide any information about the current sheet or row that is selected. Spreadsheet feedback reports the row that is currently selected in the active sheet. A target column can also be assigned so that the feedback button reports data from the column. Active Sheet reports the sheet that is currently being controlled by BitFocus Companion. These buttons can be organized and combined flexibly to expand the available functions which control the spreadsheet data from graphic layers. BitFocus Companion provides emulators that generate an interactable button interface. This can be open to operate the buttons which were created from the presets to then send commands directly to Tyler Live. This integration with BitFocus Companion offers a robust alternative to the way spreadsheet data has been traditionally controlled in Tatter Live by providing sophisticated commands and where those commands can be operated from.